Well, water, water everywhere, but not a drop to drink is the main focus of one Minneapolis theater company's latest production. For this week's In Focus, Mel Meyer talked to some of the cast members who explained how toxic water in the land of 10,000 lakes is an enemy of the people. Sod House Theater has brought the 1882 play by playwright Henrik Ibsen to modern life. Our play starts out very funny, very celebratory, and the issue sort of reveals itself as the story unfolds. The storyline follows the controversy that unfolds as the local doctor figures out that the water is poisoning people. The mayor, her sister, doesn't want to reveal it because if they do, the town will die. It's an issue that the company hopes will resonate with Bemidji residents who also depend on clean water for tourism. I think we definitely like take for granted that we have so much here, especially clean water, which is something that some places in the United States are struggling with. It's a hard plot line to condense, but the cast and crew seem to do it with ease. We sing along with everyone, it's, we talk to the audience, we play games in the beginning, it's super fun, and then we take a turn. By transforming the play into a bluegrass musical, the company has been able to shift the plot from light and funny to the dramatic. But they also want to make the music authentic to Minnesotans, doing so by holding workshops across the state to gather some ideas. We were taking that information uh, as long as uh, as well as the script, and we were writing music for the play. Both Hanson and her co-musical director Brian Laidlaw wanted to incorporate the score in a subtle way, so they needed to think about what is it about this world that makes people want to sing, or how can music really be the kind of subconscious of what's going on? But this show is also using movements to give cues to audience members about how the tale twists and turns. To there isn't really a traditional stage, uh, so we are in the space, in the outside. Physical participation in the show brings the message home. The importance of participating in your community and being informed about the issues of each community. In Bemidji, with this week's In Focus, I'm Mel Meyer, Lakeland News. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.